ibe ara no male ibe ara no si be ibe yeah sometimes i wonder i never make it to to this world so first thing we're going to make sure our eyelids are primed and I'm using my Lane Low Paint Pot by MAC. Next thing I'm using a fluffy blending brush and this is going to use to apply my eyeshadow um, uninterrupted by MAC and this is going to be my transition shade. So right here I'm taking a light orange eyeshadow and this is from my Morphe brush palette. This is the Jaclyn Hill palette. And I'm just kind of sweeping it softly on my eyelid because in the picture um, her eyelid looked pretty much neutral. So we're just trying to stick to that more neutral tone shade. Now I'm taking that um, darker orange shade and I'm just going to apply that in the crease. Now using that darker brown I'm going to add in the crease just to kind of add some more depth to my eyes. And I'm using a flat shader brush to apply that. Now I'm just going back in with my fluffy blending brush and blending those colors together. Now I'm taking um this light, it's like a light gold eyeshadow and this is going to be like my highlight for my um tear duct. And I'm placing that in that inner corner and I'm going to also wet the brush so that it's more intensified. Um, so it pops more. So that's it for the eyes. Now I'm going to take my glue and um, apply some to my lashes. And these are some um, drugstore lashes. Now I'm using my Pro Long Wear Concealer in NW35. Then I'm going to go on top of that with a lighter concealer and this one here is cream concealer from my ABH uh, concealer palette. Now the areas of my face I'm highlighting were, was more highlighted on the picture that I seen of her so I'm just going ahead and highlight that area as well. So I wet my um, beauty blender with 6 plus and I'm just going to go ahead and blend out my concealer. So right here I'm using my Sasha Buttercup powder and I am loving this powder and that's what I'm using to set my concealer. Now I'm going with my powder, Stasiana, and this is a Clinique powder, and this is what I use to contour. Now, as always, I always like to go over my concealer, my whole face, with my setting powder. And I just lightly dust it on top of my foundation, my concealer, everything. 
just to make sure that everything is well blended and everything is very smooth transition because you don't want to see any harsh line at all so that's what I'm doing and I'm using my MAC mineralized skin finish in dark now I'm going in with I believe this blush is called Aruba and this is from Sleek Cosmetics and it's just a beautiful orange blush and I'm applying it more in a angled um, direction because I just want my face to look more slender now right here I'm taking my 24-7 eyeliner by Urban Decay and I'm just going to go with a flat shader brush and on the outer corners of my eyes I'm just going to smudge that so it looks a little bit smoky. Now I'm taking my favorite mascara as you all know this one here is the Upward Lash Mascara by MAC. I'm taking Talk That Talk lip pencil, which was limited, and you can also use the Spoken For by MAC. And then the liquid lipstick I'm using is Stilla Fiery. Now I'm just adding some lip conditioner on my lips just to make sure my lips are well moisturized. And then I'm going to go ahead and apply my lip combo. So that's pretty much it for the makeup look guys. Um, right now I'm just kind of blending those two together just to create that dark burgundy matte red lip that she had. did enjoy this tutorial and if you want to see more of my videos subscribe to my channel and um yeah and if you want to see me do any uh makeup look just leave a request down below and i will surely do so so i see you guys in the next video bye